<laughs> okay. What's up? It's Tuesday. I'm Tay. This is Tuesdays with Tay. Everybody's going to heaven out today, baby. It's a record by Citizen. It's fucking out today. So pick it up. Five bucks on the Bandcamp and uh, in the uh, old Run For Cover web store. You can buy a vinyls, you can buy a CD, you can buy a cassette, you can buy all the types of mediums. You can get it at Urban Outfitters and Hot Topic and iTunes and FYE and Run For Cover web store. Look how beautiful this is. Do you want me to say other things? <laughs> Tay, what do you think of the Riot Fest lineup? Sign me up for No Doubt and that's it. Oh, Alex is on fire. Etid, love that band. Lawrence Arms, go see the Lawrence Arms. That's about it. Atreyu is gonna be there, so there you go. Jeff's gonna be there for the Mustard Plug set. The Dead Milkman, that's pretty punk. Uh, overall, there is some uh, there's some okay stuff. Pennywise, Brohan, you can, you can see that song. What is that? Tidwop. Oh, <laughs> the Devil Wears Prada. Tidwop? <laughs> Tidwop. <laughs> Tidwoop, go see Tidwoop. Tay, if you had to choose one sound sample to put in a trap song, what would you record and put in before a nasty drop? Are there drops in trap songs? Skrillex is really good at finding pre-drop uh, samples. So just listen to some Skrillex. Call 911 now! Yeah, oh my god! <laughs> yes. <laughs> Dane, what's up with your blink Two tattoos? Are they really messed up? Yeah. What's what's up? <laughs> Dang! I can only imagine how you feel, but Awful. yeah. Uh, yeah, I fucked up. My first tattoo was when I was 16, and I went to some dude doing uh, coke in a trailer park in Detroit, and got some blink Two tattoos. And I just found out this weekend that the words are wrong. I was watching this girl do a ukulele cover of of feeling this. And and I heard her sing the words, and I was like, idiot, those aren't even the right words. <laughs> but before I wanted to call her out for it, I was like, I'll double check. And like I Googled it, and I saw that it was different words, and I was like, wait, maybe they got it wrong. <laughs> so then I went and grabbed the LP and pulled out the insert and looked at it, and I got the wrong words. It's just, uh, it should be look to the past, remember, and smile. I got look to the past, remember, a smile. So, you know, semantics. There's room I could fill it in, but I'm just, I'm waking up every morning and just sharpening it in just in case I gotta show somebody, so. Yo, Tay, can I, be, can I take Bean Dip to prom next year? I fucking love straight edge people and vegans like me. <laughs> Gotta have them home by 10, and don't stop off at McDonald's, cause that's not, there's not vegan stuff there. Tay laid down the rules pretty well, just have me home by 10. Hey, who has the most money in their wallet right now? I have that much money in my wallet right now. Big fat zero. I have a ticket to ride. I got a ticket to ride, baby. Got my ID, I'm not gonna show you because it looks soft. I have a lot of debt in this. Zero cash, but I have a Cane's buy one, get one free meal voucher, which is worth more than money, and Dane gave that to me. I got my US license, I can drive. It's my ticket to ride, baby. 30? About 30. <laughs> well, here's my cash pocket, and I've got a hotel room key, um, a metro card for New York, and a free go cup at KFC. Oh, 50 bucks! Hey! And then, uh, what do we got? Crazy Doe's Pizza, $3 off any order. It's probably expired. Subte, in a previous episode, you had mentioned seeing Steely Dan with your mom. Are you going to see them this summer? They're touring with Elvis Costello. It should be pretty kick-ass. I know, I didn't get tickets. Hook me up if you know anyone. If you can get me in, hook me up. I am seeing Counting Crows with Jeff, though, in July. That's gonna be fun. Tay, man, I wanna see all the Rum for Cover office bands at one show. Make that happen. I did, I booked it. It's already happening. Uh, Fiddlehead, Death Injection, Burglary years. Dark Lava was booked, but uh, our drummer Jeff Malt is on a expedition to the volcano to get a drum set. We're getting a lot of volcano uh, noises for the LP. But yeah, everyone's playing, but not Dark Lava on Friday. Go to the Democracy Center in Boston and Cambridge. <laughs> There's so many shows. GDP Wikiphase is playing. Tiger Shaw Acoustic is playing. Al's playing. I'm gonna be at all of them. So come say hi to me. Yo Tay, your thoughts on Donald Trump running for president? Yo, that cotton candy head motherfucker has been running for president since like 2004. 
<laughs> he's in every single election, everybody laughs at him, and then he does it and he drops out. So his son shoots like lions in Africa, so I'm not I'm not behind the Trump campaign. That's just the only reason. <laughs> if it weren't for that, he's he's the perfect fan. <laughs> Yote, for fans of the show, who's your favorite Orange is the New Black character? I watched the first few episodes and fell off, so. The Crazy Eyes girl is pretty cool. I just started watching it yesterday, which is pretty wild. I don't know, it's kind of early to have a favorite. I'm only a few episodes in, but I like the yoga teacher because she voiced Patty Mayonnaise on Doug. I like, I like all the Latina girls. I like the goth girl who's into like My Chemical Romance and stuff. Maritza, the other one. Yeah, Flaca. I like Black Cindy. I like the way she looks at the world. I like her voice. I like the things she says. She talks, she says stuff in a funny way. I watched season one. Not for me. Favorite character, Pensatucky. I just like her teeth. Tay, on a scale from one to Hot Topic, how emotional were you as a teenager? <laughs> oh, were you all as teenagers? That's, that was me. Seven. Uh, Six point nine. Seven point five. Seven. Oh, dude, hot topic. Question for Al. What project are you most proud of, whether it be in film or music? In film or music. You know what? Album art for I Wish I Could Stay Here. Probably my favorite. Something I'm pretty proud of. I think it's like, I can look at that and still like it. I also really like the inlay for Further Sky. Crab did the artwork and then we put it all together. I really like that. Tay, what's the worst band anyone's ever recommended to you thinking you'd like it? Uh, I mean like Coheed and Cambria, people are like, people think that I would like that I guess, but I can't do that. I mean Morrissey, yeah. Coheed and Cambria, Morrissey, The Smiths, all those, I can't do them because of the voice. People love those bands. Yo Tay, Van Damme, Schwarzenegger, or Stallone? Well, obviously I'm gonna go Schwarzenegger. Have you seen Terminator 2? Better movie and way more awful movies. Van Damme has made more better movies, but Seagal has made like us like one better movie. So I'm giving, I'm awarding him more points for that uh, feat than for his other really bad movies. Tay, look up Ainsley Harrot Hot. That's not how you spell Harriet. My mom's name is Harriet. Look up Ainsley Harriet Hot and Spicy Meat. You're welcome. Give your meat a good old rub. That's it. Nice and hot. Hot and spicy meat. <laughs> yeah, boy. I'm gonna watch it again. Give your meat a good old rub. That's it. Nice I mean, he's hot. doing it right. Hot and spicy meat. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> I would watch that cooking show. Tay, who is the worst superhero? Ant-Man. Ant Green Lantern's pretty whack. What does the Green Lantern do? It's just like, he has like a power of imagination or something like that. <laughs> Fantastic Four, pretty whack. Shitty Hulk, Rockman. Shitty Hulk, Rockman. What's good about... Oh, Shitty Hulk, Rockman. Shitty Hulk, Rockman. <laughs> Uh, what's funny, the only th funny thing that came out of that is the Arrested Development parody on the new season when David Cross walks in and he's like, I need to get my rocks off. <laughs> That's funny. Good job, idiot rock man. Hey, Ote, can you write me a bio for my Tinder account? Put uh, some modern baseball lyrics in there or something. All right, let's talk about pubes. Ask me a question only about pubes. That's your, that's your bio. <laughs> let's talk about pubes. <laughs> There you go. Bio is let's talk about pubes. Hey Tay, who is everyone's pick in the final four for Battle at the Barracks? You guys are doing that, right? I have Shane O'Neill in my bracket, but I've gotten pretty much my entire bracket wrong, so we'll see. I did a bet with Dane, and the loser had to take the winner to a meal at the top of the hub. Dane already lost, so Dane lost like a year ago. So he's gonna take me to the top of the hub. If you don't know what top of the hub is, it's gonna be like a hundred dollar meal. I can't wait, I'm looking forward to it. But yeah, I think Shane's gonna win. It's my friend Royce's birthday. Can you send him a shout out? Like send him? Go crazy for Royce. Via snail mail? Royce's nickname should definitely be Rolls. Especially if he's a little fat kid. <laughs> 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 Happy birthday, Royce. Tay, what are some good guitars to use for hardcore music? <laughs> Dude, Gibson SG, shut it down. Any guitar 
or or an Ibanez, or an Ibanez, or a BC Ridge. Anything pointy, anything with very pointy geometric shapes to it. Look at the headstock. If it has devil horns, then it's good. <laughs> don't play it. Don't play a Strat. This isn't balance and fucking composure. So I'm back. I got bipolar disorder because I can't stop buying this polar seltzer. <laughs> Noise.